Hi, everybody. Hi. Welcome. Come on up. Make room for other people. There's a few more coming. You can scoot way up here. I'm not going to bite you. And this won't bite you. Oh, you got to watch out for the pointy things on there. Yeah? Come on up here. You can come in real close. How's everybody? Pretty good? Yeah. Yeah? Well, I, I have to say, this is what we call Homecoming Sunday. So, welcome home. I hope, I hope uh, the summer was good. I saw a lot of you this summer. Now we come back to some of the things that we do normally, and that one of those things, did any of you go to Sunday school or kind of saw the rooms and things today, and next week maybe go to Sunday school? I hope some of you do. I hope all of you do, because there we learn some very important things. We learn. You know, how many of you go to school? Yeah, and there you learn things like you learn how to, to write, and you learn how to read, and sometimes you do a little mathematics and things like that, and you play on the playground. All that kind of learning and all that kind of special stuff is, is, is very important. And what we do here on Sundays is very important, too, because we learn what our faith is about. And now there's a very huge reminder of that right in here. I didn't know if you saw this when you walked in, but, you know, this cross... I would, uh, I carried this in personally this morning when I got here. It weighs about 900 pounds. So it's just a little bit bigger than I am. And, and in it came, and I, I, I brought this in here. And this used to be right up on top of the whole building. I mean, you couldn't see it from here. You could only see it from outside. And this stands up on that thing called a spire, which when you go outside to your cars, look back up at the building, you'll see this big, huge, like, tower, and now there's a big metal spoke or spike sticking up, and that's where this thing goes, this cross. Now, do any of you have any idea why we would stick something like this way up in the sky on top of a church building? Why would we do that? Because it's big, and it's not, it's, it's not fun to, like, carry in in the procession, in the parade, is it? It's yeah. no, that's not good for that. But do, do any of you know what this cross reminds us of? It's supposed to remind you of something. What? Jesus. It's supposed to remind you of Jesus. What happened to Jesus on this cross? He died. He died. He died, and then he was buried, and then he, just like we just all said together, he rose again. And he ascended into heaven. And what all of that made possible is that you and I, one day then, because of this cross, because of what Jesus did here, we get to live forever with God in heaven. It's a wonderful thing. So this cross reminds us of the most important thing in our whole life, our whole world. And we stick it up on a building out so the whole world can see, so there's no doubt about it, what we're about. We are a church that is about the cross. If anyone says, what's your church about? You can say, it's about the cross. And if you come here every week, you're going to learn about this. You're going to learn about how God loves us so much that he gave us Jesus to die for us so that we can live forever with God. It's such an important part of our faith. You see it around the room. You see it on walls. You see it in the buildings where, where things come together. Well, look at the floor when you walk out. Do you see all the crosses in the floor? Look closely. Yeah. See, the whole floor is full of crosses. And if you start to look at things that way, you start to always be reminded everywhere you go of the cross, the cross. That's what we rally around today. That's what you're going to learn about this year. And now what I'd like for us all to do is let's all pick this up. No, we're not going to do that. Come here. Gather around it. Put your hand on it. Now, be careful around the sharp parts, as Pastor Rick earlier learned. Put, uh, be careful around the sharp parts. Put your hands on here. And this, one, this is the closest you'll ever get to this cross. Once it goes up on the roof in a few weeks, I mean, it's way out of reach. But you can say, you know, that cross way up there, I touched it. I touched it. I saw it up close. This is it. Let's pray about that. We thank you, God, for giving us the cross, yeah. every cross, as a way to remind us of how much you love us and that you have promised to take us to heaven with you to live forever. Thank you for Jesus, to whom this cross points. 
And this cross reminds us of your love, and we are thankful for that. Yeah. We ask your blessing now on our lives, all of it in Jesus' name. Amen. Now, I've got something for you. I've got little crosses for you to take from Pastor C and myself, and uh, we'll hand these out. Make sure you get one to take with you to remind you of the cross, okay? Oops. Thank you for coming. Oh. What I get to? Okay, can you give one?